Hey everyone, welcome back. In this JQL and Jira search tutorial, we are going to learn how you can quickly smart query the issues within Jira using the fixed version or effects version. Now, if you are having the Jira issues and you have tagged those issues as a fixed version or effects version, which usually in software development, you will be obviously following that uh, to manage the releases, etc. So if you want to search those issues quickly, what you can do. So basically, if I say, v in the uh, quick search and then colon and then i can specify the version that i am looking for so this is basically the effects version if i search for say for example one dot something uh let's say star which is the wild card i can use and hit enter then it will filter out all the results or all the issues which have the effects version as one dot right so this is the effects version that we are looking for okay so if i simply just put it whole here okay so if i say v1.1.50 and enter you will see that this same issue will be pulled up right now how i can search for the fixed version the keyword is ff for the fixed version and then colon and specify the fixed version that you are looking for so if i am looking for a fixed version which is 1.1.50 and enter then let's see if there are any issues with this particular fixed version there are no issues so that is why it hasn't displayed any of the issues that are being displayed there but if i change it to 1.1.51 then one of that defect should get displayed yeah one of the stories also marked as fixed version as 1.1.51 so there are two issues that are being filtered based on the fixed version so for fixed version use ff colon and the version right and for effects version simply use v colon and the version that you are looking for you can use the wild card right so say for example i'm looking for the version and there are spaces within the version so in that case say for example i'm looking for the versions which are uh, affix version which start with version right so in that particular case if i say version then it will filter all the issues that have that version right but say for example i am looking for version 1.0 there is a space in between so how can i search that so if i say v colon version and space 1.0 okay and enter then let's see what happens so in this case it didn't filter any issues there right so what why is that so because there is a space so what we need to do here in this case is we say version and then put a wild card after the version and after that say for example i'm looking for something starting with 1.0 then i can again say in term in place of uh, space i have put the wild card so anything in between will be looked for and then dot and then again if i'm looking for everything after 1.0 then just put the wild card there as well right so in this case it will filter the effects version right you you can see that effects version has been filtered and version 1.0 issues have been displayed there okay now if i'm looking for the fixed version right so similar approach let's see similar approach for the fixed version okay and then say star let's say how many fixed version of issues are there which have this version right so anything after version i'm looking for okay but say for example i'm looking for only version 3.0 which has the fixed version as 3.0 okay so i'll say ff and then version and in place of space i'll put star there and put three right and then let's put star so it will filter all the issues that are having the version as version space and then uh, three comma so basically this wildcard will have or if if there is anything apart from space as well it will filter that as well okay but in this case because we are having space then we put the star there and it should filter only version three dot and then anything after that right so you'll see that two issues have been filtered for the fixed version which are having the version 3.0 in there okay so this is basically how you are going to search for the issues within jira using the smart query for the fixed version and effects version using the wild card as per the need that you have for the querying of the issues so that's all for this tutorial i hope it was helpful thank you very much for watching see you in the next lecture